Hey guys, and welcome to the Geekbox. Hey guys, and welcome to another video. And I'll take a quick one I'm doing today uh, in regards to the fact, obviously, we've just hit the one year anniversary of the Nintendo Switch. And I just wanted to do, this isn't like a review or anything, it's just my own personal take on the Switch and obviously the first year of it being out and the impact it's made for Nintendo and on gaming, etc. And I'm also hoping to get a little interactive with this because I'd love to hear what you guys have thought of the Switch so far and what you've enjoyed it most. Uh, for me, I see the highlights have been, uh, well, Splatoon 2 coming out on there, which was a great game for them to release on it. Uh, actually, my daughter has that, my nine-year-old, and she absolutely loves it. It's a great family game. Um, obviously, there's been loads of mini games that have come out on it, and there's loads of little uh, like basic RPGs they've released for it. Like uh, Octo Tales is a great example. That's a game if you haven't uh, tried even the demo of it download it for free and trust me you'll fall in love with it uh, obviously they've released other games recently like Bayonetta 2 um, uh, Skyrim came out on it so it seems Nintendo have gone back into plugging into these big games again which is just so great to see because it used to be something they were fantastic at doing obviously uh, Mario Odyssey landed another fantastic game um, there's just so much they've done with it obviously the main thing being I mean you know, it's simple you can play it for the TV I mean, for mine, I can simply just pick it up and there you go, I'm ready to go. So, uh, yep, obviously another game they re-released on it along with all the new gen consoles was uh, Alley Noir, which again, a fantastic game to see get brought out, especially being able to play it handheld. Um, obviously the motion controls as well have made a lot of the games uh, just great for the Switch. Um, I think it's, this is the one where Nintendo nailed it. They, the Wii was a great idea, but it didn't really take off because it was just purely based on the motion controls. Obviously, the Wii U, as we know, kind of just fell flat on its face. I mean, it took about eight months for the Switch to sell more than the Wii U did in a three-year tenure. Um, but yep, anyway, it's a fantastic console. Uh, like I said, for me, I love it. And of course, the crowning jewel, I believe personally, for the Switch is Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. It's one of the best games I've ever seen. Um, one of the best games to play, full stop. Uh, yeah, it's just one of those games that just blows you away the moment you start playing it and just constantly keeps you absorbed into it. So much to do in it. Uh, really shows that Nintendo have still got that good grasp on what they need to do. Uh, obviously they lost their way with a lot of things but I think they're finding a way back into it now and the Switch is a really big step forward for them so obviously uh, congratulations to Nintendo uh, on taking the steps forward obviously things haven't been the best since like the Dreamcast uh, crash landed etc but like I said it's uh, that's a bit of interaction in this video so I'd love to see in the comments what you guys thought of the Switch and what your favourite games are just throw whatever you want at me and basically it's just the uh, it's a gem for me. I hope it has been for you as well. Uh, obviously, it's not the cheapest console to keep going. It's like uh, just buying the new controllers, etc. For it can put you back like 50, 60 pound minimum, going up to like 80 pound. But there's also like really cool stuff that goes with it as well. And obviously now you've got your builder kits and that as well. It's just constantly evolving. So uh, yeah, like I said, let me know what you guys thought of the console. I'm obviously loving it myself, as I've already said. And, well, that's about it for it. Obviously, one year of Nintendo Switch, gone by really fast. Uh, but, fantastic things. So, I'm looking forward to seeing what you guys put in the comments. And, obviously, I'll get back to each and every one of you as soon as I'm able to. And, as always, thanks for watching. Thanks for watching the video, guys. Click on one of these boxes here to see some of the other latest content from the channel. And, of course, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button to stay up to date on all the latest content.